This metal ball is trapped between two wooden posts that are held together by this baseboard and by this long metal uh, nut and bolt combination thing. There's also a metal pin in the front and in the back here. And right now, there's no way for this metal ball to come out of there. It looks impossible, but we're gonna figure out how to get it out. Uh, the first thing I've noticed when I look at these two wooden posts is one of them is completely flush with the base. This one here though, it's not flush. It has some wiggle room there. And I bet we're gonna be able to take this post out some here. If you look down there, you can see uh, that in the bottom of this post, there is a hole and there is a pin going into that hole. So if we can figure out how to remove that pin, I think this post will come up. Uh, also, I've noticed that this uh, two-ended bolt with the nut in the middle, uh, the nut is actually not screwing one way or the other. It has been glued in this position. So that means if I try to move it too far this way, uh, it gets stopped. Also, it gets stopped when I pull it in that direction. And we cannot change uh, the distance between uh, the, this nut and the two ends of the bolt. Uh, also, these side pins here, these are not coming off, so I think the action is gonna be here. Uh, but when I tug on it, I see it's being uh, held in place by the bottom. So I might try twisting it side to side. Let's see, that's not doing much of anything. You can see there, there's a little bit of wiggle room. Let me bring this back so we can uh, get me in here too. Uh, this is a, uh, this was described as a 10 out of 10 difficulty uh, puzzle. And so far I've been able to beat half of the 10 out of 10 difficulty puzzles. This one, it's deceptive because it, it looks like it should be easy. You just pull this out, but it's not coming out. Uh, so if there is a pin that's stopping this from coming out, I'm gonna try rotating this in different directions to see if that is somehow releasing a pin, but it's not. Uh, I can also try twisting the two metal things on the side here to see if that will release the pin that is holding in the wooden thing, but that's not releasing it at all. I'll also try twisting the nut in both directions to see if that's gonna release that base piece, but nothing seems to be releasing it. Right in there, I can see there's a little metal pin that's holding that tight. Uh, next thing I'm gonna try is I'm gonna try spinning the puzzle. A lot of times, if you use centripetal force on these puzzles, it will dislodge. So let's see if that did anything. Nope. All right, I'll also try spinning it in the other direction. So I've spun it both clockwise and counterclockwise, and that's not doing much. Uh, there could be a magnet in the puzzle that needs to be dislodged to release the pin. No, that seems like it made it even tighter. No. Oh, oh, look at that. Look at that. That has really come out of there. Look at that. Okay. So now, let's see if we can pull this wooden plank up, because if we do, that should free the ball. No, it's not coming out. There's something I have to do. Uh, maybe I've got to do something to get this other wooden pin uh, pulled out. So I'll try tapping in the other directions, and then we'll see if we can pull out this wooden thing too. Even though it looks like it's flush, maybe it's still gonna come out because if both of these wooden uh, blockers just lift up, then this ball will roll out on its own. Ah, but that does not want to come out. This thing's out there. Okay, I see there's a seam in the wood here, so I might try pushing this separate wooden piece in every direction to see if that comes out. It's not coming out. I can also try rotating it both ways. 
I'm rotating this other one too, pushing the center, pulling the center. I'm doing anything to try to dislodge that wooden piece so I can just lift this top apparatus up, the nut, the bolt, the two wooden pegs, and that would get the ball out of there. Let's think, what else, how else could we get this out of there? We've got this wooden peg that's coming up. So if we move it in this direction, no, that doesn't want to come, ah, maybe. I don't want to force it, but maybe I just push this up and I'm gonna get this out the space. So we'll move the nut and bolt all the way to the side there. Let me push this up there. You can see there's sort of half of a hole there. That's where the pin was holding this in. And then, is there enough space? Ah, it's so close. Let me try the other way. That's so, oh, look at that. Look at that, we did it. Yep, and now you can really see that hole in there that was holding the pin in. And let's see if we get it back. It is tight fit. Oh my goodness. How did that even come out of there? Now it won't go back in. That's the craziest thing. It doesn't go back in, but it doesn't matter because we got the ball out and that's all that matters.